from playing on the ice to having to train from home. That's the reality for many young athletes right now as Alberta's latest COVID-19 restrictions involve halting all team sports for the next two weeks. Working on your individual skills, nice. you can't compare it to being out there with your team. 15-year-old Marcus Pacheco says because his skill development is being affected, he and some of his teammates worry about what that means for their future. It's hard for these kids who are working ultimately for the end goal to either get a scholarship or, you know, play juniors or NHL and they can't showcase their skill this year. This isn't the first time team sports have been impacted due to COVID. Early on in the pandemic, arenas were shut down for a few months across Alberta. City News spoke with the Van Heist family at the time who resorted to doing hockey drills in their garage. Now with the game they love being paused once again, they're trying their best to do what they can from home. It's difficult though. I mean, talking to a, a nine-year-old who's been um, really committed to to working on his skills and has goals that he has set for himself. You're fine, Taylor. The Van Heist family, like many in the hockey community, are concerned the ban on team activities will go well beyond the province's two-week plan. I'm worried that there's going to be more strict re regulations coming and that it's going to extend. Um, we, we're already planning that this is going to extend past Christmas. The Pachecos hope it doesn't come to that, but say if it does, Marcus and their family will adjust. There's just a lot of frustration amongst people, obviously, but I mean, <laughs> it is what it is, unfortunately, and everybody just has to be safe, right? So we're all in it together. The province says it will reevaluate the latest COVID restrictions in the next couple of weeks. And if numbers continue to skyrocket, they will consider implementing stricter health regulations. From Edmonton, Cheryl Tasaskiu, City News. Christmas shopping, how the way we spend is far different this year during the pandemic than in other years. Coming up, why companies like FedEx are expecting a record-breaking season.